What's Gucci YouTube? It is your boy Philadelphia. Back at it again with another video for you guys. Let's get right into this video. Go to my classes here. First class is going to be called Tack, which is a VMP. This VMP has quick draw and grip. That's all you really need for a VMP. But some people do prefer like long barrel for the long distance gunfights and also stock so you can strafe a little bit more. But personally, I prefer just quick draw and grip because I feel like my shot is more accurate. Another thing before I go to the next class, I just want to say this class is called tack because i have on flat jacket fast mags blast suppressor afterburner and tag mag that's the reason why it's called tack another reason it's called tack is because it's a tactical class which means i'm going to be more tactical and strategic with this class going to be trying to in out the lanes crossing from bomb to bomb um probably pushing mid street uh, aggressively so i won't get like stunned or concussioned or even needed so this is why i have this class to protect me from the enemy team from stunning me if i'm trying to get away from a situation or if i'm trying to be super aggressive so let's go to streak blocker streak blocker is going to be a vmp reason i prefer the vmp is because i'm more of a i like to be a little more aggressive when i play this game i like to move around the map and stuff so i feel like a submachine gun is ideal for a player like me this class is quick draw and grip once again with afterburner flak and fast hand blast suppressor and dead silence reason this class is called streak blocker is because it's just going to block your streak not block your streaks but the enemy team streaks so say if they have like a rcxd and you're playing bomb i got the rc on i don't care i'll just kill one of the teammates on the enemy team and then just try and go find a dude that's still in the car and probably defuse the bomb or something like that i don't know but that's the reason it's called streak blockers to you know prevent me from getting blown up by rc car even a nade sometimes i've you know gotten lucky situations where i gotten away from a lightning strike so this class is ideal if you want to block encounter streak third class is going to be the sh -sh 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 shiva shout out to my boy study he'd be dominant with the shiva on land i actually got this idea from him to create this class so shout out to study the shiva has a red dot long barrel and stock because i don't know man the shiva is just dominant you don't really need too much on this gun as far as attachments um i also have a secondary because you know sometimes i might want to just toss that thing in the back pocket there and uh just go around and see if i can get some intel from my team or possibly get a pick or even if the shiva runs out of bullets i need to hurry up and swap i can just swap and get my pistol and blah, blah, blah. but um this class is just a standard search and destroy class with the um afterburner fast hand blast suppressor and dead silence next class is going to be the m8 yes the m8 black ops 2 baby let's get it the m8 just has um the same thing that the shiva has on i use the same thing on my ar classes i noticed that because you don't really need a whole lot of attachments or whatever for ar um this just has a reflex long barrel and stock um i like to strafe a lot with my ar i'm 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 a weird ar player i'm a hybrid so i i use my ar like it's a submachine gun like i get into close gunfights with my ar instead of hanging back i do need to work on that so you know and also i have on the rk5 just in case i need to once again get some intel for my team or you know get a pick or if my m8 runs out of like burst i can just hurry up and switch and get that kill this is a standard S and D class as well, as far as the perks. Perk one, afterburner. Perk two, fast hands. Perk three, blast suppressor and dead silence. Now we're gonna get on to the last but not least class, the Nate stun class, aka the Naga class. No, nah, that's not even a Naga class. This is probably a little bit more, you know, easy going because Naga goes full out with the double stuns and the double concussions and stuff like that. Um. But this is just a standard VMP class, once again, with quick draw and grip. Uh, reason I call this a nade stun class is because, look, it's a nade stun class. Um, nade stun. <laughs> with your standard S&D perks, afterburner, fast hands, um, blast suppressor, and dead silence. Reason I have a nade and a stun on this class is because... I know a lot of need spots and stuff like that, and it can help out the team. It can help out your team as well. And um, 
the same place that you can throw your nades if you know nade spots, you can throw your concussion. Actually, I'm going to change this to a concussion. I don't know why I use flashes because they're not even that helpful. Um, in certain, situa cer certain situations, they are, but I don't like for my em enemy to be able to move around. Um, the concussion allows you to stop the enemy from moving. It's kind of like a... Um, like a nerve gas or something um and it stops you it stops the enemy player from moving so this is why i call this a neat stunt class and appreciate you guys for watching the video that's going to be the end as always guys your boy Philadelphia taking off from the 99 2000s